Hey guys, Joko here. Welcome back to another tutorial. Today I wanted to look at showing you guys a cobble lava obsidian station. Um, the reason why in Galactic Science, which is what I'm playing right now, if you can see around, and I'm in creative, so um, yeah, my oxygen doesn't matter right now. <laughs> um, but one of the things you first want to start off with, obviously, is you need cobble for various things, building blocks and whatnot. Um, lava, you need to make obsidian, as well as it's a very good source of energy. Um, just about anything that you could burn will burn lava as well. Sterling generators, 200,000 RF, about 8 minute burn time. So lots of stuff. And then obsidian is used to convert to um, silicon dioxide if we look at uses for this guy so silicon dioxide silicon dioxide you can use to make um, gravel let's see if it's on one of these early pages there it is for for one silicon dioxide so that's that's a and then gravel obviously you're sifting that and you're getting quite a few resources so this is what I'm currently doing this is what I currently have set up in my world and I thought I'd show you a quick build of that so you guys could find an easy way of doing some of this stuff and this is actually a pretty nifty little build I really like it and so I'm sharing okay so first thing you want to do is you want to clear yourself a 3x3x4 three by three by so there's one two three four clickety click and then pick a corner that's going to be your front and so if this was my front right there that's my front um, I'm going to dig a little L shape here and throw some cobble down and this is going to be the um, cobble gen right here so you go ahead and throw a transfer node along with a world interaction upgrade so your first start now you've got a cobble gen now you want to know where to put it um, best place to put it is in a better barrel Oop. Well. okay fine there we go <laughs> Placing these barrels now is, is kind of interesting. Um, so that's that guy. Um, so now the next thing you want to do is you want to convert some of this cobble into lava. So the next thing you want to do is you want to put, now you can use an awesomeite block. You can also use a coal block. And I'll grab one of those and put it down. And let's see, let's, uh, let's move that one. So, awesomeite block, we're going to put there, and a coal block we'll put back here. Now, I'm going to throw a crucible on each one of these here. Now, as you can see, the one with the awesomeite block is at 8. The one with the block of coal is 1. Um, if you follow the quest book, um, it'll tell you these things. It took me a while to figure it out. Um, and then you just throw some input in there. So now you'll end up with um, some cobblestone here eventually. There you go. <laughs> so it'll it'll switch between so once it hits this intersection it'll randomly go between these two spots and um, you can see it there so I'm gonna go ahead and swap this back out with some osmite okay so now you have your lava jet now what are you gonna do with that well you need to pipe it out so I'm gonna throw some liquid um, transfer nodes on there I'm gonna run that up and don't forget to have a stick. Uh, so these sticks are very nice. Um, let's see. I want to go that way and there. So then this guy there. Nice and pretty. Um, so what that's going to do is that's going to pull the lava out. And then best place to put that in is you get a couple tanks from quests. Um, I think you get like two tanks or you make them or whatever. Um, but you can hand carry it to make um, obsidian to start off with and then the next thing you want to do is you want um, obsidian now so you don't have to do it by hand over and over again so we're gonna need one of these guys this is a stone barrel 
and then um, we need to get the obsidian out so we're going to take this guy and run it up top there. so as you can see it's starting to fill up with lava um, best place to put that in obviously another barrel so once this starts filling up now this one will always drop it in here as long as there's room and there's going to always be room because that pulls it up pretty quick this one over here will randomly go between the two and then so sometimes it'll come up here as you can see there's a little bit of lava up there and it just drops some more other times it'll go here but once this reaches um, full capacity which this setup is 32 buckets um, it will always go here and you start getting obsidian a lot faster but lava like I said you can right click this with a bucket and use it for fuel and it works out really great so um, let's follow along and make this all nice and pretty too there and then last thing you want to do is fill it in I don't have any obsidian yet come on you guys oh one thing you may want to do um, put a block back here and drop some water on here because otherwise it doesn't work there you go <laughs> it's probably not full yet but whatever where are we sitting at? oh, oh wow uh, block right there helps too <laughs> so that's almost done three four Here, why don't we help it out here? There you go. So we'll go ahead and fill this up. So there's 32 buckets. And then if you look down here, you can kind of see how fast it goes. This is my setup that I currently have, and uh, it's working out quite well for me. I've probably got a thousand obsidian now, so I've got more obsidian than I ever need. And then obviously my cobblestone is full of cobble I'm piping this out into um, a chest that is compressing it so hey guys um, thanks for stopping by I hope you enjoyed this I hope this helps you out let me know you like it by leaving some comments leaving a like subscribe and I will make more of these so take care and have a good one